Oh, hello. Welcome back to the show. Great to have you here with me again. If it's your first time checking it out, you know what to do. Smash that like button, hit subscribe, leave me a comment down below and give it a share, why don't you? It doesn't cost you anything. It really doesn't. Oh, somebody's angry, somebody's upset and somebody's deciding to silence me and take away my voice, take away my ability to share my opinion on the current goings on in the world. And if you're wondering, I can see now what current goings on? The current goings on relating to DJs that hardly anyone cares about unless you're over the age of 45. And I happened to point out a few things I saw on the interwebs that I thought was a little bit out of order. And guess what? I'm being piled on, I'm being bullied, I'm being silenced into oblivion, lawsuits, takedown, you know, threatening things, um, angry comments, all that lark and, you know, the good old thumbs down to really drum, you know, drive the point home. And if you're wondering what I'm talking about, it's Jane Fitz. Jane Fitz isn't happy with the video that I made, what, a few weeks ago? detailing some exchanges she had with the DJ collective known as Disc Woman and she's not happy with the fact that I happened to slip up and say in my original video that she might have played a play grade of a play grave of two I think or something along the lines of I think I might have said a few a couple it doesn't matter but the gist of my video was that I thought her response to Disc Woman was completely over the top and completely unnecessary they of course you know requested some funds during the peak time of COVID sometime last year around March June don't hold me to the exact date the request itself was pretty sincere and pretty lukewarm and pretty forgettable if you weren't a fan of that collective you could have easily just scrolled on by and really not paid attention to it but she decided to take time out of her day to crop that image upload it on post it and upload it to her socials and post the following message which i thought was pretty out of order at the time and i still think it's out of order now you know a pretty lukewarm request there from this woman and she decides to post there if ever there was a good reason to self-isolate is to keep me far away from these dis disgusting entitled idiots right idiots she called them idiots so i pointed out hey maybe you know considering everything that's going on in the world right now and seeing you know scores of djs who you would assume are fairly affluent flying around to you know developing countries third world countries countries where they're not probably taking covid as seriously as they probably should you know and people flying around to all these third world countries and deciding to go and dj in countries where they probably shouldn't do if they have any sort of moral or ethical compass inside their body but they go and do it anyway so i incorrectly pointed out that jane fitz might be one of those people she wasn't but the point still remains you are still a you know b-i-t-c-h to these ladies for no apparent reason and then i'm getting emails from somebody that's purporting to be her talking about she used to be the creative director or editor-in-chief in flipping e ebony magazine you know give me the order have black friends what next do you eat chicken patties as well when you go not new carnival like, I care. like what's wrong with these people are they insane this is proper you know barbara streisand effect in full order that video had like a hundred views maybe 150 tops and here they are trying to silence me <laughs> and trying to take away my ability to just comment on stuff that I'm seeing. I go out like everybody else does. I'm just a fan. I'm just a kid. I'm just a guy living in a flat somewhere. I don't know jack shit. I'm just commenting on what I see on the interwebs and here they are trying to tell me you don't know what you're talking about. You're an absolute idiot. You don't know what work she does behind the scenes. I don't care, man. I don't care about Eva. I don't care about this woman. I don't care about Jane Fitz. I'm just commenting on something and saying hey why can't we all get along and be happy. There are far bigger problems out there did jane fitz point out the issues with flipping sven var going to go dj in india did she point out the issues with i don't know who else went wherever to go and place i'm not gonna name names in case they came after me they come after me for a more defamation bloody lawsuits did she point any of that out probably not is it her prerogative to do so probably not but if you're gonna go out there and publicly bash these ladies then maybe you should publicly apologize right not state it in an email that oh we apologize get out of here i don't care I'm, they're not my sisters i don't bloody know them i was just commenting on something i saw online do you know what i mean either either party i could care less about either party i just commented on it because it was funny they were criticizing the, everyone on this woman and look what's happened now look what's happened now what's really worse someone please tell me everywhere djs go throughout the playgrave they leave a trail of bodies a trail <laughs> right a trail of bodies legal or illegal they seem to have the flipping uh, you know the opposite of a midas touch wherever they seem to land now incorrectly she wasn't there right wrong and maybe i don't know what i'm talking about let me know in the comments down below did i get it all wrong did i read too much in the situation and 
also you know maybe maybe you know who cares maybe who cares let me know in the comments down below if i got it all wrong and thanks again for checking out peace